family, everybody. I don't know what that's about. But guys, hello, hello, hello. Let me get to the light. Let me get to the light. Guys, so I had this brilliant idea. Namo Himalaya, everyone. I hope everyone's doing well. Welcome back to the channel. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm Sarah Michelle. I have my laptop on the bed. You can see it there. Yes, I was busy getting some stuff done. And um, I was just telling a friend of mine that I need to get some food in my belly. Let me... Grab my hold on eight. I was like, oh my god, I need my phone. Guys, I'm on my phone. I'm vlogging on my phone. But yes, so I was just telling a friend of mine that I want to make some um some ice cream, some vegan ice cream today. And she's like, go, 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 do it, do it, do it. Ah, here we go. She's like, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. And I'm like, oh my God. Because I've never done this before. Never made ice cream, nothing like that before. But I did buy the ingredients yesterday. Um, I was on the hunt to find some coconut cream. She's messaging me now. So the ingredients said, I got it from this guy on Instagram. Oh shoot, I forgot his Instagram name. Ooh. I'll, I'll find it on Instagram and then I'll link it down below so you can see. I'll tell you what his channel name is. Um, but yeah, so I got some coconut powder because they didn't have any coconut cream. And the ingredients on the, well, the directions on the card says to make the coconut cream, you need two third cups of, of warm water and a quarter cup of coconut powder. So we're gonna make like this tropical, um, actually, I lie, I actually got the idea from somebody else. It was not that guy. I love his stuff, but that is not that same person. It's this lady who has a daughter and I can't, I don't know, scratch that guys. But anyway, it's a vegan ice cream with banana, frozen bananas. It has pineapple and it has mango and coconut, coconut cream. And then like she put nuts in it and stuff. So we're going to, let's pick you guys up. Let's see what we've got in the fridge, the refrigerator. So I've got, ooh, If you know, you know, this is like my absolute, absolute, absolute favorite thing ever in the world, in the whole wide world, coconut water. If you don't get this, this is the real deal, guys. Not that box stuff or canned stuff that people get. Mm -mm. This is some real tropical island coconut water, okay? Right. So I have mango. Ooh. This is gonna be so good. <laughs> like I'm manifesting it to be really, really good. So I have some mango. We get two mangoes. And I have some pineapple. Some pineapple. A pineapple. And then what else? The frozen bananas. But we'll get that in a little bit. So We've got our ingredients. We've got our, why do I keep doing that on the camera? We've got our mangoes. We've got our piña. And then we're gonna have our, I'm gonna cut this up. I hate cutting pineapple. Does anybody else hate cutting pineapple? My mother used to cut them for me all the time. No, I have to do it myself. And I'm like, oh my God, I don't want to, but yeah. So I don't have a food processor, guys. This lady had a food processor and I don't have one. And so we're gonna do it in a regular blender. So let me just throw these things on the counter real quick. La 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 la. Under the sea. Yes. Yeah. So I am going to cut up this pineapple real quick. perch you guys up there i'm gonna cut up this pineapple really really quick and uh and then i'm gonna come back 
and I'm gonna let you guys see the process and hopefully actually no it's gonna take a little bit because I actually have to put the coconut cream milk in hot water warm water guys pray for me because I've never done this before <sighs> But there's a first time for everything. And I need to get some food. I am starving. Yes. So let me go get situated and then I will come back and let you see what I've got going on. All right, guys. Talk to you in a bit. Okay, guys. So I'm back. So I've got my fruits cut up. So look, I've got my mango and the piña, pineapple is here. And then I have the coconut um, milk powder to make the coconut cream. So it says that I have to, let me just prop you guys up. You know how we do in these YouTube streets. Okay, so it says that I have to, what does it say? It says, uh, Two third cups of warm water to three third cups of powder. And guys, I'm from the Caribbean. We don't do these measurements, but I'll do two third cups of two third cups. <laughs> two third cups of water. So let's go. Two third cups of water. Na, 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 na. I don't know about this already, yo. <laughs> All right. And then, based on the measurements, 50 grams is like, I don't even know, guys. We'll figure it out. If it doesn't come out well, then we'll try again next time <laughs> uh, let me open both so i can put it in at the same time all right oops all right so let's see how this is about to go let me push you guys back all right coconut milk in the container guys let me know in the comments below if you've ever made like nice cream or like regular ice cream and if like what was the process that you did to get it to come out And I think I'm gonna put it in the fridge a little bit to get it to be, all right, this don't look thick to me. Oh no. Guys, what if I did too much water? Oh my gosh. It smells good. Mmm. Smells nice and coconutty. Oh God. Why does it, why is it not thick looking, y'all? I don't have like one of those like hand blender things. That would be perfect now to just mix. Actually, I don't even know. I'm not a chef, y'all. I'm not an expert. It smells really good though. Like I should. She's one of them no nonsense women. Y'all know that song. So them girls, you know, you don't love you like I do. You. Mm -hmm. You're my queen and I won't lose you. I know you know you the. <laughs> I love that song. That's a song by a guy called Armand Warren. 
and um, he's been dropping bangers after bangers after bangers these past couple months and um, ain't nothing thick about this guys I don't know so I'm gonna put it in the fridge and then should I taste it doesn't taste like anything either it smells yummy I was about to say something but never mind y'all so oh I love that song so much like it has such a like the groove is so good how to wash the hands it's so good, man. I know you know you the mm, 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 fighting on your mm, mm. Hey. Da, na, 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 na. I'm gonna know the words soon. So, guys, let me go. Let me go. I'm gonna put this in the fridge. Probably like try to put it in the freezer and see if it helps. And then when I come back in the next clip, we are going to put it in the blender and then see how it comes out so yeah <laughs> guys i'll see you in the next clip i am back guys propping you guys up oh oh lord i should be more prepared for this right okay I was watching something. Let me turn on the, the recording real quick. Guys, this is the song that I was telling you all about. <laughs> Let's see. Huh? Yes, sir. We're gonna play a little bit because ain't nobody wanna get copywritten. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got coconut cream. It's a little bit thick for all. We've got the blender, frozen banana, pineapple, and mango. So let's throw it in a bag, bag. Frozen mango, I mean banana. I don't know how many bananas that is. <laughs> uh, let's see what was it. Let's see what the rock is cooking. So we <clears throat> are about to. <clears throat> I don't know if it's, a, it's too much or not, but be throwing the banana. If anything crazy happens, we'll just add more because we could do that. That's our business. Some pineapple. Just throwing some pineapples. You're my queen and I won't lose you. Uh-uh. Join the mango now. Let's chill. Oh, baby. <laughs> Guys, I live on a resort, right? And so, 
everybody always like they, they i'm like the first vegan that they know and they're like oh my god like what do you eat <laughs> and i'm like what do you mean what do i eat i eat food they 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 can't identify because they eat so much like meat they're not they're just not vegan so they're like Whenever you're making something vegan, like, just call me because I want to taste it. I want to try. So I told one of the guys, one of the, um, the AC technicians, I was like, so guess what I'm about to make, attempt to make. And he's like, yeah, I want to try. And I'm like, bro, if it doesn't come out good, if it's terrible, <laughs> You're not going to get any. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's see what we got going on with this ice cream. So. Huh. Uh -huh. The cover is on. Let's see what we got. Does there, is there a... There's nothing on this thing that says ice cream. So I'm really sure which one I should use. Maybe I should use this one that says puree. <laughs> All right, let's see. Oh, God. All right, guys, I'll be back. Let me just blend it and see because I don't know what's... I don't know. Mm. Guys, so... <laughs> It's the next day. I don't even know what happened yesterday. And as usual, I'm taking you guys through the dark so that I can get my tripod. I don't know why I didn't set this up before I turned the camera on. Tripod. But yeah. So... What happened yesterday and my masterpiece? Well. Well, ladies and gentlemen... I don't know. Was it a hit? <laughs> I don't think so. Oh, uh, it's a holiday today on the island, and I am uh, I'm home. I have a ton of work to get done. Um, but I I just opened up the patio door. I don't usually get the opportunity to let some air come in and you know allow the good energies to flow through. So I just opened the patio door all the way and um and i'm just you know there we go enjoying outside <sighs> sun is scorching hot all right so let's do this one day i'll get it right one day i'll get it right y'all but yeah the breeze is nice and amazing coming through but yeah, so the purpose of this clip really and truly is to show you guys the final product of what we did yesterday. So I ended up putting it in the freezer because, well, it didn't come out creamy like it was supposed to. Uh, I don't want to show you guys. But anyway, I ended up putting it in the freezer so that it can harden up. So this is what it looks like. So right now it kind of looks like a like a sorbet type of thing. Let me get a spoon. Let me get a spoon. And we're gonna taste test together, and then, oopsie, and then I'm going to get on with. With my face. Yeah, it's it's not like ice cream, guys. It's literally I feel like I put maybe too much coconut stuff in it. I don't know. But we may have to let it sit here for a minute. Cause it's kind of hard. It's not creamy at all. So either you need a food processor. The lady that did it said you don't need a food processor, but 
maybe you definitely do need a food processor and that's the key because this this is like this is like <laughs> like i can't it's so hard like i can't even scoop it up i mean hard is good but and i made like little smaller ones like in ice cube trays so that like you just pop them out and then just like suck on them like um, an icicle a popsicle but i didn't have a lot of those so i just put these in like glass containers so this is what <laughs> it looks like and this is how much i was able to scoop up but we will taste it right now so let's taste it Everything I've been wanting, manifesting for my life. It does taste like a sorbet. So maybe it's like a tropical sorbet. That's probably the best. So it's actually pretty good. It's actually pretty good. So I'm going to let it stay out for a little bit. <laughs> Guys, if you see me like, like struggling to like scrape it up, that's so crazy. So I'm, I'm going to let it stay here for a little while out the freezer and then, um, yeah, but we'll try this again on another day in another time when, you know, mm -hmm. it does melt like a sorbet. So maybe it's a sorbet, tropical sorbet guys. And um, if you're interested in knowing the full recipe, let me know in the comment section below. And um, that's it for what? Cooking Chronicles is Sarah. <laughs> oh my goodness. Cooking Chronicles with Sarah. This was kind of a hit, kind of a miss. It didn't come out the exact way it was supposed to, but it tastes good nonetheless. So guys. Until the next vlog, until the next video, uh, guys, go check out my, I have meditation videos on here and yoga videos to help you live a more balanced life. Yes, 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 for your mind, for your body, and for your spirit. And uh, the vlogs are just an added bonus to help us do what we need to do on purpose. So guys, with that, go out there, live your life with purpose, on purpose, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, y'all. No more humanity.